Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today's video is going to be another Halloween tutorial and this is like a half skull glam mask, but not really a mask. I don't know, um, but I'm starting off with half of my face glam. You can choose whatever half, but this is for the top half and I just did my eyeshadow super glam and all my makeup and then I wiped off, you know, a clean line. Um, from the middle of my cheeks to the middle of my nose and over to the other side of my middle cheek And I'm just taking this water activated paint. It's a white one obviously and I just dipped my brush in water dipped it in the white and this that's basically how you use a water Activated paint and I just put this all over my mouth area like everywhere that I would be having the skull then I use a little less water to make it thicker and more opaque and I'm adding a second layer and I'm really trying to get all the streaks out even though it kind of doesn't matter because we're going to be covering it up. I'm super perfectionist so I had to go over it like five times. <laughs> but when it dries it looks the same. I just did not realize that. Next I'm going to take a transparent powder and we're just going to be setting that because it will make things easier to blend later on. So now I'm creating the nose. You're just going to have to look up whatever shape they have because I like redrew it like five times. I have no idea what kind of shape this is. It's like, I don't even know, like a weird arrow, a girl's hair upside down. I don't know. I can't even describe that. So once you've finally finished with the nose, um, we're going to go ahead and move on to underneath the eyes. So I'm just taking that same black eyeliner with a small brush and creating the bottom lining of the sockets thicker towards the middle and more tapered towards the edges. And I'm taking more of that black eyeliner, putting it on the inside of my mouth. Like, you know, the inside of your mouth gets stained from like a lollipop or something. I'm doing that and then I'm going to like blend out and make it look more seamless. I'm pretty much using this black eyeliner for everything other than the black eyeshadow I'll use later on just for a reference and it's the Tardist black eyeliner. So now I'm taking this small brush again and drawing two lines halfway out to my cheeks and we're just going to take those out from the corners of our mouth. And this is going to be like the mouth slash teeth area so just keep that in mind. Then I'm going on the top of my cheekbone and I'm drawing a line straight out and we're going to be creating a little type of shape back towards the hairline. It's like a V so it looks like a really long Y right now and then we're adding another line so it kind of looks like a K and yeah I don't, I'm just trying to, I can't describe it. Now I'm just cleaning up the lines and we're going to take that black eyeliner and put it right on like the smallest part of that U shape and we're gonna blend it out so this is basically the hollows of our cheekbones um, this is what it would look like if actually they don't even look like this but it that's what people think it looks like so yeah that's what we're drawing anyway and then we're gonna blend it out and blend it out some more and blend it out some more all right, oh. Okay, so now we're going to be filling in the back part of the V and connect those lines again. Now I'm gonna be taking that same black eyeliner and I'm gonna be drawing a line from down my nose to my lips to my chin. I'm gonna be drawing two lines straight down that's not two lines that's three lines I'm drawing three lines and then wait I'm drawing more than that what am I <laughs> oh my gosh I'm like saying this it's like 11 o'clock at night and I know that's not late but I can't even think anyway I'm going to be shading those teeth Basically just making like the thicker line and shading and making them look like teeth shapes. I don't even know how you would do that. And then I'm taking, again, guess what, black eyeshadow. And I'm going to draw a very crisp line and then blend it down. So one side of it's going to be crisp, the side that's like against the white. 
um, and this is just under our sockets, by the way. And we're going to blend that out, and I took a clean brush and blended that out just to make it really seamless. Again, this is just going to give that kind of depth effect. Doing that on both eyes, and then doing it underneath my cheekbone and blending it downward. And I'm also going to be doing it on top of my cheekbone and blending it upward. Do that on both of your cheeks. And now we're going to be doing the chin. So this is basically a jaw outline. I'm just drawing the black all over the edges of the mask and I'm going to blend it out. This just kind of, again, creates depth and makes it look darker, more mysterious. I don't know. Add any other spooky details you want and you are finished. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure to give it a thumbs up if you liked it. Comment down below what other videos you would like to see, especially Halloween makeup tutorials. Um, so yeah, thanks so much for watching and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.